We're going to have extreme vetting. We want to ensure that we are not admitting into our country the very threats our soldiers are fighting overseas. And this is the protection of the nation from foreign terrorist entry. We're totally prepared. It's working out very nicely. You see it at the airports. You see it all over. We run away from the Iran, this country. They do something like this, but we didn't know we're going to have the same situation here. To assume that just because of someone's age or gender or whatever, that they don't pose a threat would be misguided and wrong. Several federal judges temporarily blocked the ruling. Because this weekend was a disgrace. President Trump fired acting Attorney General Sally H. It is a confused process. It didn't filter down to our... Uh, customs people uh, who it can come in, who can't. Published reports are that uh, neither the Department of Homeland Security or the Justice Department or others were consulted about this. We will probably, in some areas, give ISIS some more propaganda. It's not a Muslim ban. This is not a Muslim ban. It's by nature not a ban. When he first announced it, he said Muslim ban. He called me up. He said, put a commission together. Show me the right way to do it legally. Well, if you were a Christian in Syria, it was impossible. Very, very, at least very, very tough to get into the United States. We are going to help them.